Yeah, I told you that two times. I figured you already were staying. Oh, you decided you were. I gotta like. Right, right. That's what I figured. Well, let's figure the lights out. You know, you guys are here leaving. You start to move the lights. Yeah, it's gonna be so easy that we can't switch. And we're just like, let me press this button. Right now. Oh, it's so bad. This is a little program that I'm gonna I keep my house in this house. Constitution or state constitutions. 
public emergencies such as economic depression. That was the keyest part right there. Public emergencies such as economic it's like the timing of my hand and the doorknob today. Like should be liberally construed in favor of the clearly intended and expressly This guy pointing out like U.S. Similarly, a provision intended. Just if you know this, you know he's giving you the name of the code, what code to look up with the president an example that you put it to court and you can find it and you assert a claim of right. The judge is the fucking right two party. Huh? Two parties. I don't even know now. Like, Carl, Carl Miller. Okay. Person and property. Can you see that? Can you all see that? That's how I that deal with topics. Right the judge. How? Give me the right here. And over here. This comes and tells the judge how the Constitution is to be interpreted. This is from the Am Jurisprudence Volumes, and this is Volume 16. You want the Constitution and Law section, right here. Constitution and Law, and you want Section 97. And when you start reading it, the most important part about it, and I'll read it is, that a Constitution should, really, should receive a liberal interpretation in favor of the citizen is especially true with respect to those provisions which were designed to safeguard the liberty and security of the citizen in regard to both person and property. Can you see that? Can you all see that? Is that coming up right here? Over more. Okay. All right. To safeguard the liberty and security of the citizen in regard to both person and property. See note 31. Virus reached United States, 273 U.S. 28. And all of these 40 Supreme Court cases hold that axle. In other words, it's supposed to be liberally enforced in favor of the citizen for the protection of rights and property. Any constitutional provision intended to confer a benefit should be liberally construed in favor of the clearly intended and expressly designated beneficiary. 32. But on 32, DeJammer versus Hospital Authority of Albany in all of these cases. Okay, you see that? Okay, yeah. okay. Mm -hmm. I'm just that trying to tell you, go look this up and you can better see. Can you see it clearly now? Okay. Alright, now, let's show. do that over again. Any constitutional provision intended to confer a benefit should be liberally construed in favor of the clearly intended and expressly designated beneficiary. Similarly, a provision intended... Similarly, a provision intended... To afford a remedy... To those who have just claims should receive a beneficial construction for the purpose of extending the remedy to all who might barely come within the meaning of the terms. And that's Ryder versus Fitchy of Ohio, a Supreme Court case, okay? Uh, so. That's note number 33, okay? Now, this comes out of 16 fan jurisprudence. In other words, I have this constitution. This Constitution is a contract in writing enforceable in the court of law pursuant to the statute of frauds. I'm asking for specific performance, Your Honor, in favor of me. I am the beneficiary of the contract. 
There's also a basic premise in contract law, basic contract law 101 of any first year law student that says the contract shall be enforced most favorably in favor of the non preparer. And that's you. You didn't prepare it. Now, if you believe, honestly, that you have a right, and you can timely bring that right before a proper adjudicated authority, and you can clearly stipulate to what your right was, guess what? They got to listen. That's the way it is. That's the way it's supposed to be. And I'm telling you, if you know your rights and you timely assert.